sorry if you're the nicest on your plants. Here's where I live. This is my home. Where I can be alone. Where I don't have to worry about nothing working. Since there's nothing out there to repair, or the same you're purposely damaging something, this'll duly be reported, Frog. Nothing works. What? I had that antenna set perfectly. Don't fucking touch it. Are you gonna make me come out there and shove my hairy fist through your visor? Is that what you want? Fine. Stay outside then. You're not gonna jump, Frog, are you? Jesus, don't leave it out. me. Por favor. Where's Frog? Frog corre el riesgo de cometer suicidio en el casco exterior de la nave. I don't understand you for fuck's sake. Speak my language. Solid ground in 30 minutes. Get your ass in here. Nothing works. Nothing. Nothing ever works. Spire, Fook, where the hell are you? You sons of whores, you. Secretly observing us. Now stop cleaning everything. You're always fucking cleaning everything. Do something useful. Stop following me. Am I the filthiest person on this shuttle? You. Ingrese bajo su propio riesgo. Gracias. You think you're making fun of me, don't you? Well, boys. I dare you. I dare you to show your face anywhere on this planet. Come round for a drink, boys. Girls here. They'll look after you. They'll ease the pain I plan on causing you. about stagnating and, and this shuttle that doesn't work.
going in too fast. You're the one wasting time outside doing whatever out there. This is Shuttle Runner 23. I'm requesting clearance. Do you read over? Imagine if they all just disappeared, huh? Vanished. No trace of human life. Carried off by some mysterious entity. Well, they just escaped through the airlocks one day into space for no apparent reason. Mass exodus into oblivion. What? Uh, th th this is Shuttle Lunar 23. We need um, precise landing coordinates from you. Are you okay with our you guys? We uh, see you there, Lunar 23. Hello. Computer tracking loud. Descending. Uh, just a 3% rotation. Landing thrusters check. And we're looking good. Fly me to the moon. Take me home to Ireland. Sending 20%, just a normal rotation. Jesus, what a disaster area, man. Concentrate, will you? We're coming in too fast. More thrusters. Relax, I'm on it. Aries 2B, this is Lunar 2-3. We're all good on our side. manager's wife at some point or other. Do you think so? I remember what she looks like. Oh, do you not have any respect for women? Don't blame me for everything. It's always your fault! <laughs> Should I be filing a complaint? You must be the Lunar 23 pilots. Brooke, Inspire, I'm Drew. I work for Blackburton Industries. You may be of service to us. Follow me, please, if you can. Hey, is this about the shuttle crash outside? It wasn't our fault, was it? There was an unfortunate accident with the last shuttle departure, and our schedule's been delayed. Where do we fit into all of this? Follow me. Excuse me, miss. Is there any possible chance we can freshen up? Because I'm a little bit dumb. Krug Speyer. Listen up. This is my station. Idiots like you fly through here all the time. It is my job to see to it that idiots like you don't mess things up around here. Radio, you're the boss. Duly noted. Black Burton is interested in your services, so 
I will cut you some slack while you are here. Listen, we could use a little over an hour. It's a long flight. As shitty as your hopeless little lives are, you can always leave this godforsaken dead rock. Remember that. Black Burton Industries will pay you ten times the normal rate to ship men to Earth. That's more than any non-union clowns will earn in five years. But there will be no paperwork. No one can know of this mission for your own safety. It's a yes or no deal. Do we get to take that hot babe with us? Yes or no answer, Slappy. And we could do with the extra cash. Imagine. <laughs> no more of this shit. Retirement somewhere down the lane. But the idea of the girl on the ship, it's definitely, definitely bad luck. Ah, Jesus, have we ever had any good luck flying alone? Listen, she's hot. I drink a pint of her piss just to see where it came from. Jesus, your opinions and views and insights on women are totally and utterly unacceptable. Well, are you up for it? Sure. What have we got to lose, huh? You will get paid on arrival at Earth Station, but I've got to warn you, a lot of people don't want progress or Black Burtons to succeed in cleaning up the Earth. Didn't Black Burton fuck it all up in the first place? <laughs> it's good money, if you make it and deliver the cargo. Great. Glad to have you aboard. How is it, the girl? She's supposed to protect us and the cargo? Well, she can always kick your sorry ass. Get out. Jeez, a lot of characters around here. Just be a high suicide, right? You bringing her? I feel sorry for the poor creatures living in this type of environment. You think it started out revolution or an uprising or something? The women all look so aggressive. Must be the ventilator there. Please, sit with us. We are eager to meet with you. Please join us for tea and sympathies. What? Me? I am Dimitri, and this is my good friend and colleague, Mr. Yuri. We are from the Canada state. This is true, I'm not shitting on you. We sell fine Canadian vodka. Best of Muma area. You are no doubt supply pilots, yes? Maybe. Well then we drink together, please. Come, fine Canadian vodka. Come, please, drink, please, please. Nah, drink. Next time. Okay, okay. We meet each other again soon. No, sure, but doubt. Hey, please take free sample. I will do. Idiots, eh? Are you sure you two are able to fly? Sure. That's a working lady. If you enjoy comfort, you'll hate it here. And we have to share it. Hold on to something tight for liftoff. It gets a little bumpy in here.
Okay, fuel is go. Cargo secured. Thank you for visiting. You are no longer welcome. Here. Sure. Give us cargo! Slow down out there! Oh, we will kill your family forever! And you! Oh. The Russians from Canada. Survive, huh? Ignaz is gonna kill us. Then fire us when he sees the damage to the hole. Who were they? Who sent them after us? Better go check the damage to the hole. Sure. Okay. Grant, just some crazy Russian bounty hunters tried to ram us, that's all. I don't see any cause for panic. I think they wanted this. What's in it? Possibly the answer to Earth's agricultural problems. Do you think it's kind of important and you trust us to get it to Earth? You seem to have everything under control, right? Yeah. <laughs>
Better for the name only. Is that all you ever do, is eat synthetic food? No bloody wonder you have behavioural disorders. I persuade myself to enjoy it for lack of any alternative. You know, they have machines now that can turn genetically modified food into organic. Damn technology. It's a vicious endless circle. Nothing works. Speaking of which, your cleaning bottle's driving me mad. Put it to sleep. Fix the coffee machine. Fix this. Fix that. Why don't you ask your mechanical spy to fix something? Useless piece of shit. When we get the earth, we'll fix everything. What if we don't even make it, huh? What if we're floating around in this tin can for another 530 hours of breathable oxygen, give or take? Floating aimlessly into oblivion, not even being paid for it. Well, it's all the while being watched by creepy service mechanisms. You, <laughs> with your little beady ocular unit. Morning, hotcakes. You want to try some of this delicious, nutritious paste? It's food. I can cook anything, you know. I jumped of the ocean last night. It's funny, I've never even been on Earth. It's a cesspool. Be thankful you're not in it. Don't you think? Stiff as a board. I don't want to hear it, Spire! If she's a vegetarian, you better keep your plants out of the way. Jesus, I never thought I'd be so attracted to a first gem with no sense of you. No touching her, you got that? I'm not gonna lose my retirement over your libido. Why do you think she works for Blackbird? Made a bit of a makeover and she could be like one of the hottest it thing. Doesn't matter one iota. All you gotta do is think money, retirement. Clones don't mix with first gen humans. Focus. Sometimes I feel too good to be a clone, you know? No, I don't know. Toda la información se registrará para efectos de evaluación psicológica. Por favor, hablar libremente. You're just a voice on the computer. You're not a real human being. I need a real person to talk to, you know. It's lonely out here. Frog thinks I'm crazy and lazy. <laughs> Maybe disturbed. So I can't really talk to him now, can I? You know, one day he'll turn me into security and never look back. But I can't understand the words you're saying. My Spanish got lost somewhere back in my creative years. What about you, though? What if you were a real human being? Would you be happy here? <laughs> kind of sexy voice for an inanimate object. Kind of makes me horny somehow. 
especially on these long voyages. You know, when you do that serious voice thing, I'd like to do fucking unnatural things to you. I mean, I would like to do them to you if you were a physical being. Does that make me crazy? Su tiempo ha terminado. Gracias. See, I'm getting hard on right now. You can't even help it. It's in your matrix. We should do another session soon. I'm sure you can help me relieve some of this stress. from a shipment a while back. No genetics, no touching. Sorry. Why is your computer's voice in Spanish? Matrix problem. We got an operation system kind of sort of free, so we can't complain. And do either of you speak Spanish? <laughs> no. that thing do? Careful. Front sensitive about that bot. You might hurt its feelings. Sorry, but it looks like scrap. It's got asthma. You should update, you know, modernize. Even your tablet is ancient and it speaks Spanish. It works just fine and it was cheap. Why would we change it? Because that's what people do. They keep up to date. Not us. We're quite happy the way we are. Look, I can fix anything. Who exactly is it that tells you to keep up to date all the time? And why would you listen to them? This old shuttle may be out of date, but you're here, aren't you? Not scattered all over the moon's surface. That's because of corporate terrorism. Right. Well, no one wants to blow this old shuttle up now, do they? Well, they will now. Mm, that's because of your top secret cargo in the back, though? Did you know that on average a shuttle loses between eight and ten rivets upon landing? Over the years that makes thousands. Some are replaced, of course, if they're spotted. Makes you wonder what's holding this old girl together. Another interesting fact. In three out of five shuttle disasters, the pilots and crew are killed before the passengers leaving them to figure out how to escape all by themselves. We can always use the escape pod, maybe get us back to Earth. I'd like to smell something real again, like on Earth. This ventilated air is horrible. It doesn't exactly smell like roses. Unless you can afford a luxury city. But that's first gen luxury only. There's something different about you two. And all shuttle pilots are quite so lively. <laughs> I've been up here a long time, love. Humour keeps us sane. Por favor, hablar libremente. Are you asking me, am I happy? No. Is anyone? Once read once that people who search for happiness are never happy. It's not easy being me, being a clone. All I do is travel around the solar system cleaning up shit. And Spire, he's not easy. He's very complicated. But don't think I don't know what you do with all this information. You know, I know about the conspiracies. And you shouldn't listen to what Spire says. He tells too many stories. He can't be trusted. But you know, actually, you're the only person, I mean, I mean thing, that, that actually really listens to me. He, he pays attention to how I feel. 
how I think. You know, I like these ideas of, you know, um, coming home and, and the fire lit and, and your slippers sitting beside the fire and the smell of cooking and, and the person who loves you and cares for you and, and listens to all that you say is waiting on you. This is really nice. This, this is something that I dream of, you know? You know what I mean? I'm not crazy. It's not crazy to think of something like that, no? I don't understand anything you were saying. It's all lies. Firefruit, is that your piece of shit I see coming my way? Beef mix. Oh, we're making real money now, I tell you. After this run, we retire. Got that? Retire on Earth. No one could retire in your debt. See you back in hell, gentlemen. Beefnik, you, you bastards! Oh, incoming! get lost, did you? You seem to spend a lot of your time fixing things. The place are constrained budgets. I practically built these shuttle engines from scratch. Almost. Still a work in progress. Your life's work? Yeah, well, let's hope this shit finally fixes all of Earth's environmental problems. Unlike the last few. And then what's next for you? After this delivery, Frog and I will be home free and retired. Probably bored shitless and wishing we still had these pathetic jobs. The life expectancy of a clone isn't a long one. We're just along for the ride. Something else, won't you? Leave it be! You know that thing's not alive, yeah? It doesn't think and it can't feel. For all you know, it might be actually enjoying that. Somebody actually paying it attention at last. Don't push it! Have a seat, man. Relax your mind. Come on. That's it. Did you kill him? Nah. 
He's at rest. Mine is always nervous. Don't watch me dump a refuse load into the void of eternity. Anything we need to discover. Isn't dumping waste in space illegal? <laughs> legal? It's a federal offence. I do feel a little guilty about it. The station charges 5,000 to drain a septic tank, so between money and guilt. Ah, uh, you choose convenience. Come on, I'll teach you how to fly a ship. We don't want to go into an uncontrollable spin. Can you feel the weight of the shuttle? How she moves through space. Gliding. In trouble. Excuse me, gentlemen. You two seem a little bit too real to be clones. Genetic anomaly, but thanks for the compliment. We're Black Burton Industries. Breaking news out of Caracas. The Global Helping Hand Project has implemented immediate evacuation procedures for the entire South American continent. And it is also requested that pets larger than 20 kilograms be left behind. I wonder what channel the good news is on. Will we even watch it? <laughs> <laughs> One Brazilian official reminded his constituents that vigorous prayer is the best way to endure such hardships and that God does not even listen to prayers until four million are registered. You keep that expression on your face, no one will ever touch you again. This is serious. Why, why are you never taking anything serious? I mean, at this rate, we may need how many land to live on. Never lose hope. It might not be there when you need it. You never take anything seriously, damn it. This is our investment. It better be there when this job is finished. Why am I the only one that worries about these things? I know what you need. A rematch. No, 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 my head hurts. Pussy. You owe me one. Double or nothing. Come on. Right there, Mr. Energetic. Show me some balls. Pull this arm off. Go! Ah! 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 Who came, Frogman? Oh, show me some enthusiasm there. I'm in no condition to do this. My best years are behind me. Holy shit, you know it. You just could never play for shit. This is not right. I mean, it's all up and down. After I don't know. I mean, it's not right. It doesn't work. Nothing works. I never cease to enjoy spending your money. Damn you. 
Damn you and your inbred genes. You know what you can do with that money. You can shove it right up your... <laughs> Tell that to your accountant. Ah! Oh, Jesus, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You want to learn to control the temper, hold. Looks like the mad box needs some medical attention, no? Thought you said you fixed it. It works fine. Nothing works. Fantasies right now, aren't you? Leave me alone. I just don't want her to break the thing. to cause nausea and heartburn, followed by the occasional side effect. It really hits the spot. And it helps the remaining hours disappear faster, that is, if you survive. Isn't this stuff illegal on board? <laughs> illegal. It's against most regulations. But we're all alone out here. Do be offering more of that. She may not be able to handle it. She's human. She can handle it. I'm not as innocent as you may think I am. You know, I do sense some severe emotional baggage. Oh. That's good. Another, please. Where'd you guys get this from? Those crazy Russian bastards that tried to kill us earlier. It's Canadian. So it might be poisoned? I tested it on myself earlier. It's grand. Are you sure you guys are really authorised pilots? You should try flying with the beef necks. <laughs> they still be people with sticks. camera is invading my space. My space is being violated. <laughs> Change it is, it's 
when you play the cards, one, two, we could we play a quick game, right? It's quite easy. We get seven cards each, right? I'm a I'm on the Milky Way. Oh, yeah, this is so sweet, this song. Be so on the stars. Is that crazy? No, we get louder. 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 We get Okay. I think we should do something. Blue. Where's the med kit? I don't know. Shit! 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 This is all your fault! Yeah, with your brainwashing tummy! It's not mine, it's Canadian. What do we do? Good idea, let's try it. Wait, I didn't say anything. I don't know what- It should work, it should work. What will? It will work, and trust me! I do trust you. Wait, I need that. Because they'll kill us. Stand their fires. We're never at the end well. Drew, we need you to stay alive, okay? Our livelihoods depend upon it. You're not dying, you got that? Come I on, stay away. need these problems away. right now. Stay away. wrong with the med box? Is it on? Hit it! Yeah, just a Do on. something! Fix it! It's melting on her! Look, it's okay, I've got it. This is a bad shape. Check this out. Don't show me that! Fix her! Oh, it's acting really weird now. Holy shit, she's not real. What do we do? Do we tell her? I, I don't know. Look, we'll just get a well if we get this happen. No one needs to know anything. What's a crank with a mini butt? You think it's just fucked up or what? Blue circuit? No. This chip is just blocking it from revealing the information. It has been ever since we got it. Who the fuck would put a bomb in a beautiful woman? I mean, that's sick. She could go off at any minute. Do you think she knows about it? Jesus, I hope not. Pretty good disguise for a bomb, though, right? Anyway, I wouldn't have nightmares about it. Black Burton just wants his cargo delivered, or to stop it from falling into somebody else's hands. As long as Drew and the cargo are okay, we're all good. All our medical past is stored in Epbot's memory banks. Just imagine what it has to say about us now that it can tell the truth. But what? That we're third or fourth generation? I don't want to know the truth. We need to find out. This is more important, asshole. Touch her, we all die. She's pretty damn hot for a bomb, I can tell you. I guess that was the whole idea, huh? We're real. Who would have thought it? You don't look real. There to you. Give us a cigarette. We need to seriously rethink things here. Spire, this is big news. It has serious consequences as well. She said I deserve a drink. All that clone medication I've been shooting up over the years has messed up my genetics. We must have parents somewhere. I mean, why would they not look for us all these years? So they don't give a shit. Don't say that. Look, we're corporate slaves. Just think of all the women I must have impregnated over the years by accident, thinking of as a sterile clone. I must be a dad somewhere. 
You got any cigars? <laughs> Are the astronomically high back pay they owe us? We're gonna need a cheap lawyer, Frog. They lied to us. How could they keep that information from us from all these years? How could they do that? Computers. All lies. Look, we need to feck off to somewhere primitive like a jungle. Or a place that has no wall sockets. How do you think she'll feel when she hears the news? Which is worse, to find out you're a clone or a human bomb? <laughs> or both? That's not our problem. I feel ill. damn ship. Are you feeling okay, sweetheart? No need to panic. Stay calm. Are you calm? Spire, what's going on? Yeah, it seems to be a bit of a life-threatening situation on Fulton at the moment. Don't worry, it's all good. What, what do you mean, life-threatening? I knew I set these coordinates right. There's something going on here. Perfected computers. Never trust the machine. I think sick. I think sick. How far off course are we? Ah, uh, we're off by a few degrees. Enough to miss the earth station by a few thousand miles send us off into deep space. Sounds like you want it to happen. God damn you for poisoning me. This headache will never leave my head. Alerta. Let me know where we are. Come on, come on. Just a sec. Okay, computer is the new coordinates. Three degrees port. Fuel! 34% grand. Well, why is it? Why is the reader? It's not coming up on the screen. Hurry up, we're gonna die here. They should be there. Let out the fly first. Nothing good that works. Stop yelling at me. Thrusters four and six are not functioning at 100%. Well, let them deal with it. Who's them? Hold it, hold it, hold it. Three, two, one. Shit! We're up a creek and there ain't no bubbles. Run back and check the thrusters, right? Make sure you check them. Give me a give me a shot and let me know what's happening. Everything's fine. Fire! What's the story? It's now or never, Frog. Think we're gonna make it? <laughs> You're asking me. <laughs> Jesus, that was close. Just imagine. No more retirement. No more living on the beaches. Living off slave labor. No more drinking then. Well, at least until we arrive, maybe, huh? <laughs> Do you even have your licenses? It's at home with the permits and the operation manuals. This is Lunar 23, course corrected. Estimated. Time of arrival, 22 hours till we hit the station. We're doing fine here. Yeah, we'll fill out a report as soon as we land. Over.
sleeping with my fucking mother? You son of a bitch! How many other women would put up with your crap? Back in the land of the living, I see, huh? Is the emergency over? What happened to me? We had a tad too much to drink. We got the Matty back to check you out. And did it find anything interesting? Not really. Um, you've nothing to worry about. But, uh, stop going through our stuff. Hey, your strawberry plant's dying. What? You seem nervous around me, Frog. No, no, no. It's just that um, you're distracting us all. How are you feeling? Better. Scurvy. Is she yours? She will be. Pretty. What's her name? I don't know. And I don't care. When I meet her someday, I won't bother to ask. You hungry? Sorry about that. Who did you have to bribe to get this? We bribe everyone. So one survives in this business. But we could only afford the heads. And try to find a whole fish nowadays. Seems they only grow them bodiless. Short in the fuse again. I thought you said you fixed it. <sighs> Happens all the time out here. Computers. Fucking drone shuttles are taking our jobs and our livelihood. You know, not every shuttle disaster is fatal. We survived some of the most horrendous crashes out here relatively unharmed. And did you know, not every crash is pilot related. I mean, thank God, right? Look at us. That this action what? is only temporary. Temporary? What does that mean? That's our land, our, our investment, everything that we have put into that. Everything. I just I just can't believe it. When you think of the poor souls who give their lives for that land, from the likes of the O'Neills, Connolly, McDonald, Sands. Yeah, but we're first gens. We got real blood in our veins. We're alive. We can do anything we want. Living in space is suited for clones. They can deal with this shit. We're not designed for living here. We will die sooner or later. I guess I'll go just fix that fuse, huh? Do you not care? Do you not have any respect for the world? Do you not realize that the world is dying? Where are we going to go? For a walk. Expecting somebody else. Uh, you and Frog are so different. Yeah. He always tries to be something special, but I always manage to bring him down to my level.
really a clone, are you? Sure. Do I look human to you? We tried to kill your dog, by the way. The one you left here. In critical condition now. Critical. <laughs> Gen to me. Uh, don't believe everything you see. Spend a lot of time with first gents. It rubs off on you. It's nice not being such a corporate stiff now, isn't it? I can be very exciting. Frug, what the hell are you up to? Going for a wee walk. Don't you open that door, you crazy son of a bitch! Frug! Your intestines off the hull like all the other fucking guys. But I like it outside. Stop acting like a deranged clone. You passed a psych test. You're a real fucking human. I should be the one going out there, not you. I don't know what it's like to be human. I don't know what it's like and what it feels like. I feel as if I should have done something more with my life. Fine then, go on. Kill us both, I dare you. What are you doing? You actually want to kill me? Listen to me. I may want you dead sometimes, but not like this, you crazy bastard. You're the only one who's sane around here. Get a hold of yourself. My life would be shit without you. Oh, my bullshit is meaningless. Where's your stability? Everybody always leaves me. I'm so damn worthless and superficial, and I know it. As a team, we can make it, right? What would I do up here without you? It's so boring. Do my best, you know. You're lucky to see the butler to me. Thanks. Where's Drew? I don't know. You go up front, I go out. Come here, you. You sure you're okay? You can't do anything funny now, are you? It's weird. When I thought I was a clone, I dreamt what would it be like to be the worst generation clone. I never dreamt that I would be a first generation human. We should leave, disappear somewhere. The earth is a lost cause. We're true. No, we dump the shuttle, go somewhere, or maybe collect the insurance. Oh, Jesus, we can't just ditch the girl and fake off. She's a clone, not to mention a human bomb. Maybe we can find her original.
What's going on? Open up. Move it! Move it! Something's going to hit us! We're going to hit something. Satellite. Computer's calculating another course. We don't have time. Manual override. Give me the control. Leave it be. Let the computer sort it. Stop arguing with me and take us in. Manual, we don't have time for this. For Christ's sake, the computer's for shit. Yeah, yeah, you fixed it. You're always bragging about how you can fix this and fix that. Turn off other. these damn alarms. Oh, shit. We're not going to make it. Nothing will not be. What? Brace yourself. This is going to hurt! Alarm. Bad crack! Where's that fucking fire extinguisher? Could be pulling it. Folks, what would I do without you, huh? Yeah, you should think of that a little bit more often. I would appreciate it. You know what you need in your life is a little bit more organization, and you'd be grand. Keeps you from being animals in the street. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Possible problem here. We may have a distraught girl running around. What? You and your damn reliance on computers. Who made you pilot? Don't blame me on this one. Are you in control of this ship or are we going down? <laughs> Good question. Drew! Might as well find this in a hundred years. Floating around the distant camp. Died alone in this before the oxygen ran out. You're a first gem. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Why clone myself for you? I don't even know what or who I am. Yeah, tell me about it, but I'm not leaving here without you. I'd rather take you than Frog. Come on. Are you two capable of getting your acts together and helping me fight against this corporation? Sure, sure. No problem. Listen, there's something I need to talk to you about first, though. Let's go. We'll fight them from somewhere in the jungles. Come on, baby. <laughs> Jesus, be fucking back. This damn human body. Wait, 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 wait. Give me a second chance. Give me a second chance. We're going, frog. Alarma. Alerta. Get the friend on his lips. I think her pavement does now crash them. What the? What have you done to her? She could detonate at any moment. I can fix it, honest. We'll be grand. This is bad crack. We need to contact the station or right now, and that's it. And tell him what? We fucked up. We're dead, don't you see? Ignats and his beef necks as skin as alive for losing a shuttle and cargo. Blackbird will do the same only more violently. Terminado. Nothing works. Come on, it's time for 
for us to leave now. We have to go. Bad! Where are you? Bad! Please! A short second more butter. I give up that. I thought you both had years of experience with problems like these. I don't believe those horror shit stories we tell. We're just stories, Bay Dockers, who run errands for extra cash. Those stories just make us sound more interesting. Where is it? Bob, where are Shine. Got rid of the extinguishers ages ago. Saved this little beauty for emergencies. Just like the one we're experiencing now. Good job I thought ahead, huh? You want some? No! Yeah. Do you still want her? Listen, you're a first gen human now. There's a whole new world out there for us. Yeah, but something stopped her from killing us. It's a sign. <laughs> Fantastic. You're in love with the emotional train wreck and you brought her on board with us and she's about to detonate. So what? She's a bomb. I'll disarm her somehow. Drew here's about all I could ask for in a woman. Even if she is artificially produced and dangerous. Yeah, you just keep drinking that later fluid. By the morning, she'll be forgotten if she doesn't blow us up. <laughs> Bastard, you're just jealous she likes hey, me and not you. This is all your fault. Stop! Stop, stop! She made fucking that in It's okay, love, it's okay. <laughs> 